1 to 3 sync in server mode is a way of centrally synchronizing multiple users with multiple Outlook and Exchange folders. Once you set it up, it's up and running. Basically, each user has its own set of ca contacts, calendar, and tasks, and you can sync them all using the click of a button, or you can set it up to run in the background. In addition, if you have groups that have sales like marketing, hot leads, or any other groups in your ACT database, you can set up these groups using our custom contact uh, mechanism to actually synchronize those with the Outlook fold, the corresponding Outlook folders as well. So from one place you are doing all these things. So in addition if you want to go beyond that, beyond the model of one ACT database to multiple Outlook folders and custom users, we also provide you a way of selecting multiple ACT databases to go to multiple Outlook folders, therefore providing with unlimited ways of synchronization on Exchange uh, for you. The setup of 123Sync is quite simple. On the left you have uh, the the contacts that are not bolded are the ACT standard users that are in the database that is our main database. The contacts that are bolded are our custom users. So for the standard users, i.e. One, one ACT database with multiple users, you can match them to a, a set of contacts that are in exchange. So each contact, if you click here, and go into the contacts, each contact is on a different exchange folder. So by doing this, um, you basically, from a centralized location, you are synchronizing multiple ACT users from one database over to uh, exchange folders that you select. Now, we provide one to three synchronizer also introduces the concept of custom users. A custom user is a user that is created using the administration um, tools. And for each custom user, you can map any set of Outlook folders uh, using a, a login that you know. So for um, we know that Chris Huffman can log in into the main ACT database uh, using the, his login. So we want to create a, a custom user with the same login. It logs in at Chris Suffman, but what it does, it actually takes the data and puts it in a different place. So you're actually matching um, data uh, management from the ACT database to a different Outlook folders. And in this case, we actually put the contacts over to the marketing folders. In addition, a custom user you can ask, you can create filtering. So in this case, we just put the Tech One filt uh, seminar over to the the contacts. Finally, each custom user can also have as an, an alternative database. So you can select a database that you want to synchronize. In this case, you, you log in a sales for the sales database we just selected. Oh, here's sales one, three. Login succeeded. So what happens now, You're for this particular custom user, you are now matching a sales database to a set of Outlook folders. Therefore, we provide in the server settings, we provide the capabilities of synchronizing anything to anything uh, within ACT and Outlook and Exchange. 